Camores made an announcement at Monday night's Belpere City Council meeting that made the room give a standing ovation. Our Laura Bowen was there and has a story. According to Camores construction manager Steve Lehu, Camores has tentative plans to invest $1 billion to expand a local plant. This would make it so the plants could produce materials needed for the future semiconductor chip plant that will open by Columbus. Remember COVID, all the vehicles sitting on the lot could run because they didn't have a chip. Well, they're going to make the chip in the United States and then make it in outside of Columbus, Ohio. Lehu says the potential expansion could bring hundreds of jobs to the area. The future of this expansion depends on federal EPA approval. A petition supporting the plan can be found on Facebook and LinkedIn. Also at City Council, members passed the final reading of legislation that will help fund multiple water infrastructure plans. For instance, replacing old lines and potentially lines with lead. Multiple locals spoke out in support. Without this action, our city stands to lose brand dollars and the opportunity to provide enhanced and necessary water service to businesses and residents. Memorial Health's Luke Smith was one of them. He said that the legislation will help fund infrastructure that will help with water pressure at the health system's hospitals. To run an adequate ER, you have to have a laboratory attached to it. The laboratory equipment has to have adequate water pressure to run things like lab results. He said that Memorial Health currently has sufficient water pressure, but had to get equipment to make up for the city's water infrastructure in order to achieve that. He added that the legislation would also decrease the risk of hospitals losing the ability to operate in the case of water system issues. An alternative water feed would prevent this. Smith highlighted the importance of this legislation with the incoming Women and Children's Hospital. Laura Bowen, WTAP News, Belpre.